In this video, I'm going to go over practice number two. So there's a few different ways we can do this drawing. One, we could draw these lines just around like that. We can draw these two circles. A couple of different ways to draw the circles too. Probably one way I would do is do a two-point circle from here to here, and then from here to here, then trim it out. <clears throat> and then we, to find these, we could either use offset to find the centers, an offset, or we can use the from option. Um, we could also draw the outside by drawing a line here, offsetting the line, drawing a line, and offsetting it. So I'll do it two different ways. You can see both ways. So let's look back at that. So that was 4 by 5 by 3 by something. So let's draw that. I'm just going to draw a line. 4 by 5 by 3 and over here somewhere, right? <clears throat> now I'm going to draw these circles. They're both a diameter of 2, right? Diameter of 2, radius of 1. They're both the same. So I'll come over and draw a two-point circle from here. Go across two. And now I'll come from here. Oh, let me turn that tangent off here. And I'll go over another two-point from here. Go over another two. And then do some trimming. So just trim, cutting edges of all of those. And I want to take out that line, that part of the arc, and that part of the arc. So now I have the outside looking like it should. <clears throat> so now it's, it comes to these. So how do I want to do those? First, I'm going to offset to get those, to get this one. So I'm going to offset 5, or 0 0.5, 0 0.5, then 1.5 and 2. So offset 0.5. Now I have that corner. So now I can use a rectangle command with fillets of 0.2 from that corner. And I want it to be 2 by 1.5. And there's that box. Erase those other two construction lines. And then for this polygon, I'm going to use the from command. So that's a hexagon one inch across the points. One inch over, one inch down from that corner. So I'm going to go to the polygon. Six sides. The center is going to be from that corner. So I'm going to say shift, right click, from that corner, say at negative one comma negative one, and it's inscribed right because it's across the points, and then it asks me the radius, but I know the diameter, so I'm going to put in a radius of 0.5, and there we go. Another way we could draw it would be to draw just construction lines going horizontal and vertical. Now we can offset those three inches there, four inches there, five inches there, half an inch, half an inch, two, 1.5. So we can do a lot of offsetting and then do some trimming. So I'm going to trim all of those, take all of those off, all of those off, all of that off, all of that off, take that off there. Those two can go, those can go, those can go. Those can go. Those can go. I'll just pick those and delete those myself. 
probably do the circles the same way with two point. Go over two. Two point. Go over two again. Do that trim there. Offset one and one, and then do my my hexagon here. And then you erase those lines. And you can see by doing an offset, I have a lot of erasing and trimming to do. So that's why sometimes doing it, just drawing the outline works a little bit faster. And then I still need to take care of these corners. And I can draw with the circles, or I can use fillet. So I'll use fillet here. Radius, 0.2. There, there. There, there there to there, and there to there, to get it. So that's how to do this assignment.